What is happening everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You have Brody here for another exciting video. Today I got my hands on some mystery boxes, some mystery tins, if you will. And these are the basketball versions. So we've messed around with the football versions. You guys, if you saw our last video, uh, I did not enjoy those because I thought it was just kind of a uh, a way for MJ Holdings to basically throw a bunch of packs that you can get at a much cheaper rate into tens that are going to be more expensive. But with this, this is a little bit more exciting because we get to open two 2020-2021 uh, Panini Prism Packs and also two 2020-2021 Panini Don Russ Optic Packs. So at least we get a little bit. Now, obviously at the price point here, it's $25 for one of these tens, I end up doing this a lot. I'll just like write the price on here so I don't forget it when we do the video. We're getting six packs of Prism and we're getting six packs of Don Russ Optic from 2020. Does that equate to $75 worth? Because at this point we're basically getting two blasters, right? I don't know, uh, you guys can tell me, run the numbers, I did not check that, but all I know is uh, these, I can't really, I can't get these in the store. I mean, I could probably order some blasters off eBay, but I can't get these in the store. And so we have to rip these, we have to see what's inside. And uh, just, you know, if you guys see these mystery tins sitting on your shelves at your Walmart, that's where I pick these up. Uh, actually, I think I picked these up at Target. Uh, you know, see if you want to pick them up. But the tins are actually cool to collect, I will say. And we do have our two Prism and our two Optic. So that is good that we have all our packs. And uh, let's jump into it. We'll start with Prism first and see what we can get. If you guys like more of these videos of where we're trying kind of new products that we see pop on the shelf, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Also like the video down below and leave a comment. All that stuff really helps. And let us know too, I want to start a giveaway for um, March. So coming up, I want to do a big giveaway. Let us know what you guys want in the giveaway. Should we do another Frisbee giveaway? Should we do a box of cards? Let us know. I also teased having one of Kelsey's cowboy posters signed by Kelsey uh, as a potential giveaway as well. All right, so we're going to start in. Here we go. Gary Harris to start. We have Patrick Beverly. And you know what, guys? I am going to actually switch. I normally go left to right or right to left. I'm going to start going left to right. We're going to see how that goes. Our first rookie is going to be Jemias Ramsey. All right, let's get Optic. I actually don't even know Optic wise. I haven't really opened too much. So you can hit some good numbers in here. It looks like, I don't know if there's autos, signatures, checkerboard, ooh. You get a checkerboard in here, that's nice. I like, I gotta tell you, I like the color combo. I am a sucker for that cool teal color combo here. Hopefully this light's okay, let's see here. Let's go there, there we go. All right, Miles Turner to start us off. I also really love the style of this. Sage just told me that they might not be doing uh, optic football this year. Is that, have you, what's the word on the street there? Have you guys heard that? We do have a cool card in the back. We have a CJ McCollum and, ooh, a My House, Giannis. That's a cool looking card. I've pulled a couple of these kind of style cards in Donruss Optic UFC this year. But this is my first time, I think, opening Optic Basketball. All right, Devontae Graham. We have another silver. Terrence Davis. Our silver is going to be Kyle Kuzma. That's a sick photo. You can get some really cool photos in basketball. And Bobby Portis there. I wonder too if they if they end up taking packs from the same blaster here. Like are they are they basically taking a blaster, opening it up and putting two packs in a 10, two two other packs in a 10, two. Like are they basically just taking two blasters and putting them in these 10s? 
curious about that. All right, John Wall, Christian Wood, Jordan Nora, and we have a splash on the back, splashed, Tyler Hero. All right, so that I don't believe was very good, but to be expected when we are dealing with these mystery tens. What are you guys' thoughts on like the repacking? Do you like getting into repacks? Do you like opening? I think for me, it has to be something where I get variety. So I think this would be even cooler of a product if all four, if all four uh, packs were from a different product. Or if they said like a guarantee of you know, basically this would be like the worst you could get, right? You could get two prism or two and two optic. This would be like the worst you could get. Or you could also get like a mystery pack thrown in there as well as a bonus. I think that could make this exciting too. And and maybe a little bit more worth it. If they could maybe throw in a hobby, uh, hobby pack or an H2 pack or something like that. A no huddle pack. Uh, you know, one out of every 15 or 20 tens. Similar to like a case hit. All right, it looks like we have a silver rookie in this one. Mo Bamba. We get another Ramsey. And our rookie is going to be Aaron Nysmith, the Celtics. And Josh Hart is going to be on the back there. Okay. Haven't hit really any names yet that make you go, oh, wow. That's crazy. Let's move this trash can closer so I don't have to reach. All right, uh, Kyle Kuzma, Ray Rookie of Onkongu, I believe. And a winner stays. Winner stays, black. Is this numbered? No, it's not numbered. Kawhi Leonard, winner stays. That's a cool looking card though. That is a really clean looking card, wow. Nothing crazy, I don't think. All right, we'll keep. Pushing through these packs. We have a Dennis Schroeder, Bobby Portis, and there we go. Anthony Edwards on the rookie emergent. Okay, there we go. And Will Barton. I do love the photos. I really do. This is our best poll so far. Anthony Edwards on the emergency em emergent. Wasn't his uh, base rookie card. It is a insert, but better than nothing. All right. The lighting and glare is not great there. I'll have to try to figure that out. Maybe I can go a little more up and down. Does that make it worse? Can't tell. Oh, I think that's coming off of this. Let's see if we pop that up. I'm not sure where that is actually coming from. This one? Hmm. Hmm. All right, well, maybe I'll just set it up back there. There we go. Still trying to figure out the lighting situation. Sorry about that. We'll continue on here. I think once you start putting them in the top loaders, that's when they kind of get kind of weird. All right, Russell Westbrook here. Let's see if we can get anything out of Optic. Ooh, looks like we have a purple in the back. Our rookie is going to be Kyra Lewis Jr. And we have a rookie, Denny Adige. Oh, boy. Denny Ad Avdija. Ad 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 Adija. Mm. On the purple, rated rookie. All right. We will keep going. Last one, Jaw. Finishing it on Jaw. Does he have something? Hiding in this beautiful mystery tin for us. I gotta tell you though, I do I do like the tins a lot. The tins are very cool looking. I got I gotta be honest there. What if I did this? No, that does that does absolutely nothing. Gives you a little bit more. You can see a little bit more, but okay. Final tin. Ja can we get anything special here. What do I want to hit big out of? I feel like I want to hit big out of Prism if I had to pick one or the other. 
All right, we have a red here. Evan Fournier, pull from the back. Aaron Holiday and a red, red wave, it looks like. Rookie. Oh boy, come on. Be someone I know. <clears throat> Daniel Oturo. Otor yeah. All right, Daniel Otoro. Not numbered, but very cool looking card. Very nice. You guys will have to let me know too about some of these guys. Like I said, if you've watched some of our earlier videos, you'll know uh, the last couple of years I've been I've been fairly busy when it comes to uh, my free time. I don't have too much of it, and when I do, I'm kind of spinning it. There, James Wiseman. I know that name. I'm kind of spinning it. Ooh, T minus. I'm spending it on disc golf for the most part and the other businesses I own. So I'm very weak in my basketball knowledge. That's a sick looking card. What the heck is this? We're gonna sleeve this up. because I'm not really quite sure what this is, but I'm sure it's probably just a normal insert. But with that being said, it does look very nice. So we'll give it the, we'll give it the uh, respect it deserves. We'll give it the respect it deserves. All right. So I need it. I need to brush up on. We'll save Prism for last. I need to brush up on some of my basketball. But yeah, twenty. This is 2020, 2021. Nah, I was. Uh, I was not thinking about basketball at all. Just like I'm not thinking about trying to open this pack properly. All right. We have some black in the back we have another one of those cards so that leads me to believe it was not a crazy insert at all our rated rookie is grant ryler and on the back not a rookie jimmy butler this is not a prism though that one in the back looks a little bit nicer all right final pack here if you made it this far appreciate you guys so much for watching make sure you drop a like down below that helps us uh keep doing these videos also check out our eBay. We post tons and tons of new cards on there. Everything that's on our eBay account is stuff that we have pulled right here on YouTube. And we appreciate all your guys' support. Keep doing bigger openings here. Jamal Murray. I don't think we got anything here, do we? Ooh, I say that and we have an instant impact silver of RG Hampton. RG Hampton from the Nuggets. All right. That is a cool looking card though. All right. Well, I'll, I'll go look up some of the comps on these. See if we uh, ended up pulling anything. I don't think we probably made our money back. But when you do these mystery tens, I don't think you're going into these thinking that you are going to make your money back. You're going into these with the idea of like, oh, it's going to be fun to rip some older product and we get to rip Prism and Optic, so that's always a good time. I'm gonna be really sad if Optic Football is not a real thing. I was really looking forward to ripping Optic Football, maybe trying to go for a downtown hunt, but uh, we'll see how that all shakes out. But I appreciate you guys, thank you so much for watching, we'll see you in the next one. Keep ripping them packs.